yeah, like, I like my nails, like, I like this, I like the soap, I like the sink, it's just, it's giving, it's giving classic. <laughs> She's around, nothing else matters If I don't, someone else will Wanna love you, girl, wanna love you, girl Wanna love you, girl, wanna love you Wanna love you, girl, wanna love you, girl Wanna love you, girl, wanna love you Hi guys! Welcome back to another video Another weekly vlog, actually Round two Today is Sunday, I am currently on a layover I am in, where am I even? I think, oh, Portland, Maine. I just got back from the microwave to heat up my dinner because your girl is doing better with saving her coin. So I'm trying to get back into the flow of the, of the mindset of just like coming to a hotel, only really having time to like sleep and eat. This one was on the higher end of a short. It was right under 15 hours, which is still considered short. Um, but you know, just like I'm so used to these layovers where I get to the hotel and I have 24 to 30 hours, um, to do what I want in parlay. Hold on. Let me bless this food. It's hard not to sleep your life away because you know, you got to go to bed. Other than that, I just kind of been lounging around, finally decided to heat my food up. So that's what I'm doing right now. Anyways, there's not going to be much happening on tonight's portion of the video. I'm going to eat dinner, shower, and then, you know, get myself in the bed and try to, like, go to sleep, considering the fact that I just took, like, a two-hour nap. Um, but I'm definitely going to try to still go to sleep because I'll be dreading it tomorrow if I just stay up all night. Tomorrow's work day is pretty easy, actually. Um, and I'm done as early as, like, 11 a.m., so that's really cool. And I'm going not, I'm not going to go to sleep tomorrow. I'm going to actually like change my clothes, find the nearest like coffee shop and work. Um, because I need to have tons of stuff I need to edit and just like really just want to like utilize my time. I'm trying to do better. You know, sometimes when I'm at work, it's like a toss up. Like I'd much rather be home and ha and worrying about like editing and all my entrepreneurial things but like I love my job but it just kind of feels like I don't know maybe I need to get my health and fitness like more on lock but sometimes it just feels so hard to go to work and then come on my layover and have to do more work like no a flight the three flights take me out like I just want to relax i want to stare at a tv and not have to think about like really doing anything you know what i mean and then on my days off like actual days off i'm running around doing everything else being a mom taking care of the crib like you know just like trying to find the balance of it all i'm not i, don't, I wouldn't say like i'm struggling or unhappy with like my schedule and life and stuff if anything i've found way more alleviation i just need to buckle down lock in and work on my layovers like girl you're tired but you'll be okay Especially when, like, you know, when you know you got to get shit done, you're going to get it done. If you really want it that bad, you're going to do it. And so, I just got to get myself, I just got to stop being so damn lazy. Like, I don't know, but I'm showing myself grace this week because I do start my period in, a, in about a week. And usually the week before my period, I'm always so just fatigued and just, like, I listen I like to listen to my body if I'm tired I'm not about to go force myself to go work out well let me rephrase that depending on where I'm at on my 26 day cycle 26 28 day cycle as a woman my personal body clock if I know I'm in that week before the gym I'm sorry if I know I'm in that week before my cycle I'm not going to force myself to do anything I don't want to do because I'm tired for a reason. My body is gearing up to shed an egg and bleed and punish me for not being pregnant. <laughs> See, I'm sorry, but we got to get rid of these bamboo utensils, babe, because I just almost got a whole ass splinter. I just talked for 10 whole minutes. <laughs> um, you know, if you're new here to the channel, welcome. I promise you my life is not boring. This first clip is just not all that attractive. 
but we're here nonetheless. Excited to start my second weekly vlog with you guys. And make sure you subscribe to the channel if you're not already. So many new people here on the channel. Hey y'all, thank you for your support. I love making content for you guys, genuinely. Um, so yeah, comment below, start some chats. I'm always on this camera talking. So, and it'd be feeling like I'm having real conversations. So I love when you guys reply to the things that I'm talking about in the comments. For doing all this talking while I'm eating, so let me finish dinner and I'll see you guys a little later. We just got rerouted. It is nine, I'm sorry, 10, 19. We actually didn't just get rerouted. We've been rerouted actually. I looked at my thing around like 9.30. And just so happened to be looking to see if I was off on July 7th so that I could go to see Insidious the night that it comes out. Comes out. Babe, why did I have two C-Nos, which is like crew notifications? Why I had two C-Nos rerouting our whole entire day tomorrow? Not bad. It wasn't a bad reroute. But instead of pick getting picked up at 5.05 a.m., now we get picked up at 4.20 a.m., and your girl isn't even a lick of tired. So I'm about to shut the TV off, turn the lights off, and try to like force myself to go to bed because it's already 10, 20. I didn't know because usually scheduling calls, which is so strange, right? So I call my flight leader's room and I'm like, hey girl, I'm super asleep. I was like, so sorry to wake you, but they changed our schedule and we depart at 5.35 a.m. now, not meaning we were supposed to be leaving the hotel at 5.05, so. I had to call because the van is going to be so much earlier now that I was like, oh, I got to call so she can call everybody because she's a flight leader. So she like would need to like update everybody. She had to go figure out our new van. We'll call down to the hotel and figure out our new van time and all these things. So ciao. Look at me saving the day because had I went to bed without looking at my schedule, we wouldn't even known or we would have gotten a call at like 2 three in the morning which is not a good vibe like at all no one wants to be called in the middle of the night when we're trying to rest change for tomorrow is actually decent the only thing that sucks is we have a sit in detroit so we're supposed to they are deadheading us from maine to detroit <laughs> sit for two and a half hours and then they're deadheading us from detroit to our layover tomorrow which is in louisville but it's crazy because we were only supposed to be working two flights tomorrow from here to Atlanta and then Atlanta to Louisville. We're still going to get done at the same time. But the best part is we don't actually physically work at all all day tomorrow. So the operation seems like it's in an uproar. It seems like it's all kind of delays and reroutes going on from what I'm seeing from people I follow on socials that are flight attendants. So I won't hold my breath about tomorrow's schedule simply because we do have a two hour, two and a half hour sit in between our flights so that's just room for them to switch us around but i doubt that'll happen i doubt that'll happen because of where we're going um i really don't think that that'll happen but we are going to a base so that really leaves room for them to do like really whatever for to us they might be sending us to detroit because they might take one of our other junior flight attendants and put them on something else from detroit like there are so many things that could happen but we're just gonna go with the flow so i'm need to go to sleep the bet awards are on i didn't even know they were coming on um i was watching nickelodeon and then all of a sudden like what it was like eight nine o'clock and the bet awards were just playing so i'm like i didn't change the channel or anything but anyways i've been watching it it's been decent um anyways i need to go to bed because pickup is in less than five hours so time to get some sleep i'll see you guys in the morning made it safely to Detroit. Turns out that flights weren't able to make it out of Atlanta last night because the weather was so bad. And so the aircraft and flight we were supposed to take this morning didn't even make it to Portland last night. So that's why they had us deadhead here to Detroit. We just landed, I slept the whole flight almost. Um, and so now we have already placed our Starbucks order, but we're headed to our next gate. We're actually taking a CRJ to um, Kentucky, which is like our smaller aircrafts, connection aircrafts like Endeavor and those. So anyways, one flight down, one more to go. And remember, we're not even really working. We're just sitting on the plane like passengers. Right. It's called a deadhead. So, right. I think we're... anywho, let's get to the Starbucks. 
have you secured. Praise the Lord. Made it to the telly. What a long but not long day. I didn't work one thing today, like not one flight at all. Dead ahead all day, like what a nice reroute. And I'm so thankful and grateful because I know there's a lot of flight attendants out there today and yesterday in Atlanta getting rerouted and just cancellations and all kind of stuff so bad weather and then i'm seeing a whole bunch of stuff on social media about how bad the weather was in atlanta yesterday and just like people's fences falling down light poles on the ground like i'm seeing that it was really really bad so i'm just like grateful that my family's safe i'm away and not having to like fly and deal with the weather so today's reroute really worked in our favor although we did have to get up about an hour earlier than we anticipated um we're done it's noon like literally 12 o'clock we landed at 11 15 we made it to the hotel it's about noon now and i'm having some applesauce because i'm pretty I'm pretty hungry so i messed up because i was gonna edit on the first deadhead and i was looking for my hard drive looking 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 at freaking out because i'm so ocd when it comes to my belongings and like really putting things back where they belong but i guess i was editing on my couch and left my hard drive on the couch so i don't even have it with me can't get no work done mind you it's 12 o'clock i have hours of just time and i actually have the motivation right now to edit and it's annoying because i, do, I can't do anything because i usually i keep stuff on my sd card but lately i've been transferring stuff to my hard drive because um at one point my sd card did fill up i can't have a productive work day unfortunately um and then i was gonna start i was like okay well guess i'm gonna binge netflix and i heard that there's stuff to do like around this hotel and stuff but like going out means spending money and y'all i'm really trying to buy a car soon so i'm trying to buckle down on like excessive spending and like unnecessary purchases and just like even down to trying to eat the food that i have brought to work um because i have a horrible habit of cooking food and then still eating out so like there's nothing wrong with the food that i have i need to eat what i got i have a microwave inside of my room which is always a plus if you know me you know that that is like chef's kiss um for me because if there's a microwave in the room i really have no reason to leave at all like i don't need nothing everything i need is right here so um i was like okay well guess i'm gonna enjoy my time and lay around and binge netflix even though i kind of did that yesterday i took a nap yesterday though so um i didn't really do too much of anything i really should go to the gym if i'm being honest i should go work out i put workout clothes on like i literally have nothing to do right now because I, I can't do anything i didn't bring the proper stuff so uh, i don't know child but anywho that's what's going on work day is officially over pickup tomorrow is 5 45 a.m and it's go home day tomorrow so i'm excited to go home like yeah anyways that's what's happening right now y'all if something exciting starts i'll pick up the camera but we got a whole week together so i ain't too pressed for this uh these days here at work to be full of any type of real content no need to ask my man. I'm gonna try to So if you're feeling right, grab your quick tonight. If it's your song tonight, then it's on tonight. Say, bounce with it, drop with it, lean with it, rock with it, step with it. All my ladies on the left with it, do it, do it, do it, do it. You know the world we rocking to it, do it. Are you over me? Okay. Oh, each finger is going to be a different color? Yeah. All right, let's start. Yeah. Home, it is the next day. day. It's the next day. It's Tuesday. Hey. Mom. Mom. Stop. You ready? Turn the light on. I don't need the light. I have natural light from, from God himself. All right, so which do you want your thumb? What color do you want each finger? Thumb. Okay, we'll put Thumb's this one first. Thumb's just going to be this color. Thumb purple. Okay, what's the pointer finger going to be? Mom. Just. No, I... tell me the order. Okay, so thumb, thumb this color. Just keep them over here, not on the paper towel. Then the pointer finger. Is that teal color? And the middle finger will be that blue color. All right. And then the ring finger and then the pinky will be pink. That makes sense to me. All right, let's do it. 
I landed around early, actually, 3.15. And then I thought I would make it home a lot earlier, but I didn't make it home till like, five like four four fifty five o'clock so i kind of just like ate me a little something and then um I'm took waiting. a breath i know you're waiting you can wait a little second longer took a breath and then hopped back in the car and I'll picked nova it. up so are you shaking it up what you know about that <laughs> so anyways i'm about to paint nova's nails so ready to get your nails painted yeah okay let's do it here we go. You know there's a nail polish in this finger. <laughs> Let me see you flat. Ooh. I can even make a triangle. Very cute. Love the nails. Tell me about them. What made you pick the colors? So, uh, these colors are very, very beautiful. Because some of these are my favorite. Color. Yeah. I made orange my favorite color because I do green and my favorite color. Orange is a new favorite color. Uh-huh. And those other colors I haven't really used. And some of these colors are topical. Tropical? Right? Tropical. Topical? What's yeah. topical mean? Um, that means like classic filming. Classic? Yeah. Tell me about classic. What does that word classic mean? Classic is like when you like something really much and it's like so beautiful, like that silver microwave I really love, and that silver fridge. So these are like classic appliances, is that and what you're trying to say? that like... Dishwasher? Blue, yeah, that blue dishwasher, like wow, so when you see that. So silver. those are classic, yeah, like your so classic. classic. And then that, um, that little plant up there, oh, down, yeah. is so beautiful and classic. So that's and those shelves are so clean. Super clean. Okay, so that's how you feel about your nails. Like everything mm -hmm. is just classic and cute. Yeah, like I like my nails. Like I like this. I like the soap. I like the sink. I, it's just it's giving it's giving classic. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna let these dry and then I'll eat dinner. Read my book. Okay, we'll read your book tonight. Let me put ketchup on this one because I know sometimes you don't eat both halves. So I put ketchup on that one, so eat that one first, okay? And then if you don't get to this one, it's okay. We can package it up for tomorrow. Okay? Sounds good? Huh? It's the same. It's the same burger, baby. Mommy just cut it in half, and I gave ketchup to that one, okay? Why? Because I know you only sometimes eat one half of the burger. Did you say your blessing? <laughs> In my last uh, weekly vlog, you guys seen that I ordered a new bookshelf. So I'm really excited. I think I'll probably either put that up tomorrow or Thursday. I have two days you got off. A yeah, I got a bookshelf. Oh my gosh. I know, right? It doesn't even look like a bookshelf. Like, if you look at this, like, what? This can't be a bookshelf, right? But it is. And I cannot wait. Woo. I cannot wait to put this up and show you guys. It. so i'm super excited about that but i want to film this i think this is probably going to be like my first video of my home decor channel so if you guys are not following home tone on youtube that is where i'll be doing all of my like home diy um you know all the things the things that i used to be into i finally created a platform just for me to have like a creative space to just be able to do that without confusing my followers that are here like i know you guys subscribe to me for like flight attendant and mom stuff here but i really wanted a safe space just for me to feel creative when it comes to like home decor slash home design interior vibe because you guys know that's like my real passion deep down so i'm really excited i have so many ideas about this place that i want to get off like i'm just ready i'm ready to start filming and i think that the bookshelf will be the first video that i do which is kind of like a little bit of a weird video to start someone's channel out with but i'm thinking who cares let's just start it's not about all the analytics and all the strategy and things like that like i just want to start a channel that i'm not like so focused on growing more so just like 
wanting to just feel creative and have a space to express that kind of stuff so i'm really excited to like have that channel and to just be able to freely create without with zero expectations so that's exciting um i started this clip because i i needed to open my amazon package and in my in my last week leave vlog i also ordered this i also ordered a new phone stand so it's this um and honestly i just got it to go on my desk because i feel like um this would be really good to just like prop my phone up real quick you know what i'm saying can i see what it looks like can I yes see you what can okay girl go eat oh it comes with this little stand it look two pieces it comes in the box and then i just oh it looks like just push it right push it right in there it takes a little bit of force oh there it goes it has two little hole ridges and it has like little holes that go inside Mommy, yes that looks like your laptop holder it sure does my ipad holder mm -hmm. Ooh, she's cute yeah. i like the color that i got and it can go for, this is as far as it extends this way and then straight up this way so let's see does it hold this way oh yeah all right here she is yeah yeah i like that a lot and honestly like i'll just leave my phone there <laughs> like and think about like when i'm on the computer i'm working da -da -da -da, ping, i get a message oh i can see it oh if i need to a lot of the times i do stuff like on my ipad on my phone i do a little screenshot i do a little screen record i don't even have to pick up my phone i can just literally boom 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 wham bam thank you ma'am take a video okay so yeah, whoa, that's a cute song, let's save that. You see how quickly I'm just able to just navigate? So anyways, love this, love this a lot. Also, I can bring it over here and if I need to film any reels, it, usually I film reels on my actual vlog camera, but really quickly I can just be like, oh, let me film myself washing dishes or cutting my flowers literally like this is perfect and so Mommy, here i am like, boom 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 doing my thing and all i have Mommy, to do, do a TikTok on your phone. i know i should and you know although i do have a really easy navigating like pop-up tripod it's super easy to like whip my tripod out and just do what i need to do but this is even faster like what just sit my phone down and film and it's pretty straight like the picture so i am very happy that i purchased this um i will link it on my amazon storefront the um the link will be in the in the description box or you guys can scan the qr code here in the corner for sure okay let's put her back how's your dinner yeah. hanging in there eating good you eating eat five since i'm five I whatever you don't finish we'll pack up and you can eat it again tomorrow okay Wednesday. 
today is my sister's birthday and Chanel's birthday. So you already know today's gonna be busy. Um, not necessarily with my sister. My sister flies out tomorrow to Orlando because they're going on a Disney cruise. So I don't really know if I'll see her today, but you already know Chanel got plans. So so now all I really have to do is like get my hair together because when I showered last night, I didn't even bother like wetting my hair. I just kind of like I just kind of figured that I will deal with it today <laughs> when I get dressed. I also need to pick an outfit. Um, but Chanel says, so we're going to breakfast at Grits and Eggs. Um, Chanel says she's going to put on leggings. So I'm not going to take too long getting dressed um, or put too much thought into like what I'm wearing. Anyways, it's a good day. I'm feeling good. The sun is shining. It's hot outside. So let's have a good day. We're going to, I'm going to do a little bit of makeup though. I think if I have time. Um because I got that makeup by Mario in my last weekly vlog. If you haven't seen it, make sure you watch. Um, but, and I really, I really liked it. So <clears throat> I would like to like put a little bit of a face on today just for the sake of it. Cheers to Wednesday. Let's have a great day. Okay, here's the fit. Some jeans, real simple. I had zero time for makeup, so glasses it is. These work. Um, I bought this purse so long ago. This is actually my first time wearing it <laughs> so i thought it went well the two little pops of color and i'm just gonna wear some white flat sandals we'll leave it to the neighborhood tea dealer to get okay tea where is she going <laughs> hi happy birthday it ain't quality, but it looks so it ain't looks so soft. at target i'm in <laughs> we're at publix <laughs> getting things to sip on for the rest of the day Woo! This is what adults do when they celebrate yeah, birthdays at, at the 30s. <laughs> this is like the best feeling ever. Getting everything you want. So Nova's gonna get this. Where's the birdie? Oh, it's sad. What's that sign say? Can you read it? What? Up there. What's it say? Work hard and be, and be nice to people. Ooh! Look at these! Let's see. Is it comfortable? Is this a hundred dollars? Yeah, I can tell. Oh, wait a minute. It's comfy. Ooh, you look cute. <laughs> you got it, Nova. Sit on it. How's that feel? Comfy? Maybe mommy will invest in these later. Go, go, go now. Go, go. Get it in. Get it in. Get it, get it, get it in. Get it in. Get it in. Get it, get it, get it in. Got the moves to the left, left. Got the moves to the right, right. Got the moves to the front, front. Now bring it to the bike, bike. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna fight with it. <laughs> okay, hey, let's ah. get it, let's get it. Hey, hey, we in, target with it, target with it. Hey, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Hey, let's get it, let's get it, hey, let's get it, let's get it. hey. She got the blanket. <laughs> she got the blanket. <laughs> chill day we had a time yesterday for Chanel's birthday and I need to clean up the aftermath of it all so I got some fresh air coming in I just opened the wind I just opened the sliding door I'm about to quickly clean this up Nova is home today just for pure choice um, I wanted her to stay home so we can go to the pool and just hang out and um, she was also up really late last night because, you know, we had company. They were here pretty late, like definitely past midnight and the kids were not asleep. So, um, I was just like, you know, we slept in this morning. Nova woke up probably around like eight and got in the bed with me and we slept even longer. So now it's, a, it's about almost 11 <laughs> and I'm just really starting to move around. Nova's been up for a little while. I'm just kind of hanging out. Uh, I think she maybe woke up maybe like an hour ago. Like officially got out the bed about an hour ago. So, so she is. I'm allowing her to watch her iPad today. Y'all know I usually don't. I usually do not do iPad on the weekday. 
only like TV screen time and stuff on the weekend. But says she is staying home today and I gotta get some stuff done. I just said, you're fine, girl. Go watch your iPad, mommy's gonna film. So anyways, that's what's happening today. We're gonna, we have to run to Target again today because I didn't realize I didn't have a bathing suit here for Nova. So, and we've been going to the pool this summer, but every time we go, we're at my parents' house and she's been wearing the bathing suit that we have over there. Um, so I didn't even realize I didn't have a bathing suit here because the one we did have here, we sent to school um, that day because they have water day on like Wednesdays or whatever. So I was like, dang, we don't even have a bathing suit for you. And I definitely want to go to the pool today. So that is like majority of the plans are to clean now. We'll have some lunch and then we'll go down to the pool. This is not normal. I would never go to sleep with my place looking like this, y'all. Like never never ever ever there's something sticky over here on the floor we got the hookah stuff out we got dishes in the sink you got wine on the cabinets so that's not normal for me i have a severe i get flustered when that when there's like a bowl in the sink when i go to sleep at night but i was like now call me head ass but i said i'm gonna leave the place exactly how it is I was like, I'm going to leave it just how it is and film a ASMR clean with me in the morning. So that's what I'm about to do. It's, I'm going to film it real style. I'm going to put you guys up too for a little time lapse. So let's just get the place cleaned. getting dressed um i don't know if you can see but it's my bathing got my bathing suit on we have to run to target because i think did i mention earlier how um i thought i had bathing suit thought i had a bathing suit here for nova turns out the only one we had that fit her this season um we sent to school what hmm i said what nothing Made it to Target. No, but show me what you picked out. Ooh. Okay, that's cute. Ooh, that one comes with a hat. Yeah, that's cute. Okay, let's grab like a pool toy or something. You want that one? Yeah. Alright, I got the beach ball. They don't have a lot of floating toys, but they have a lot of like toys that like sink down. So it's kind of hard because she likes some sort of float, so she doesn't really um. You want to get those? Yeah. So she doesn't um. She can't go down to the bottom and get the toys, you know, unless I'm in the pool with her. So I'm trying to only find things that float. So these are floating mermaid and friends, and then she got this big floating mermaid, a beach ball. And I guess these water guns. All right, let's get out of here. The Can pools. You have for me? Sure. I yeah. All right, let's head out. Hey. I'm coming back in. Me. 
made it to the pool. Still hurting. Okay, you want to get out? It's a good pool day. It's not really anybody here. The girls have come back over, so we are big chilling for a little bit. from the pool nice and fresh and my grocery order just got here i pretty much just got the ingredients to be able to make chicken fried rice oh and another box of spindrift so this time i kept it basic and just got the lemon and i didn't get two this time i just grabbed one because i still have a few in there so as long as i keep purchasing them you know what i'm saying i don't have to buy too many in bulk i know it's late but i really think i just want to lay down for a second or just like rest my eyes i want nova to take like a little 30 minute cat nap so we're gonna like lay down for a second it is like 5 54 which laying down for a nap seems like so maybe i won't lay down because i feel like that'd be a waste of time let me just let myself sit in the bed for 30 minutes i haven't just laid there all day today so maybe i'll just lay there for 30 minutes set an alarm and then get up and i'll start cooking the chicken fries i was being super lazy so we got mcdonald's we woke up about 7 and now it is 10 o'clock so Nova is about to be laid down. I'm packing my bag for work tomorrow which is pretty much packed. Once I put my toiletries in the bag it'll be good to go. Time to get up, okay, pretty girl? Okay, dressed and up ready for work. This is how I'm gonna wear my hair today because I don't know, it was in those braids, but I didn't like actually put product in the braids for them for my hair to be like able to stay out. out. So we just gonna, I just kind of pulled the front back so it's not so crazy all over the place um i'm doing a two-day trip today i have three legs doing an indianapolis turn and then hello and then to phoenix and i get to phoenix around like eight o'clock you okay around like eight o'clock phoenix time 20 hour layover and then i leave phoenix tomorrow i leave around like 5 p.m phoenix tomorrow and get back here around midnight so that's the trip it's a pretty simple trip um i'm really not mad at it ready to go get this mini real quick and come right back so i can enjoy my sunday with family so let's have a great day happy friday by the way freaking day 10 12 i'm officially in the hotel um y'all i had a like a i definitely had like a whole 13 hour day today like your girl is actually tired i had plans to have some dinner once i got to the room but i'm honestly might just get in the bed and go to sleep <laughs> kind of starting to get hungry again because at first i wasn't hungry at all anyways i don't know what the night holds honestly i'm just glad to be in somebody's hotel room child like wow good morning it is saturday we got two more days left of this vlog well really today is the last day i usually like to kind of ended on saturdays or sunday mornings but i did end up ordering food last night y'all and you're gonna be so disappointed in what i freaking ordered but yes i got taco bell last night so that was good and i finished marvelous mrs mazel last night oh my god y'all why was i crying at the last episode i tried so hard to prolong watching the show like finishing it because this most recent season is the last season so it was really hard for me to like finish it because i really it's a really good show if you've never seen it it's on amazon prime it is just like such a cute 
show. I'm trying to sit y'all here. I might have to like boom like that. Uh, and so the last episode literally had me in tears. Like I was on the phone and I was like sobbing. <laughs> um, just about like, I couldn't believe how emotional it had me. Um, anyway, so now it's the morning. It's about 10 23 i woke up about an hour ago so i would say i woke up right at like 9 20 ish um and originally i had woke up at like 7 a.m and of course you know it was bright outside 7 a.m here is about 10 a.m in atlanta so 7 8 9 10, yeah 10 a.m in atlanta so naturally you know your body is like uh hello it's time to get up girl so today i ordered chick-fil-a Yes, praise the Lord, that is Saturday because I was thumbing through DoorDash trying to figure out like what I wanted to eat. And then the moment I seen Chick-fil-A, I was like, oh yeah, bet, let's order that. Real go-to, real standard, I know what I'm going to get. So <laughs> I just got a chicken biscuit, hash browns, and an iced coffee. Um, I really, 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 really need to work. Like I need to edit some videos, both mine and Chanel's. Um, what Chanel needs me to work on right now, I don't even have it. So I'm going to work on my own video because I really would like to post my weekly vlog tomorrow. So yeah, I'm about to eat, get some editing done, get in my editing bag, and I'll hit y'all up later. Up and ready to head out to work. I'm about to throw my uniform on. I finished um, finished a client video, have it uploaded already to YouTube proud of me um and took me maybe like a 30 minute nap and then got in the shower and got myself together so ready to go downstairs i'm making this clip quick because i need to throw my uniform on and get out of here but yeah i'll catch you guys in atlanta tonight like midnight hello technically we're back in atlanta it is the next day i landed around 11 45 p.m i got home by like 12 30 12 45 in the morning and i was up pretty late actually i didn't go to bed till like four o'clock so i'm just now kind of like really gathering my bearings what time is it? It's 10.04. So good morning on this nice Sunday. Um, Nova's hanging out, watching TV. Um, and we're just going to have a pretty chill day. But I wanted to come on and officially end this vlog. I'm going to just go ahead and wrap it up here so I can start next week's weekly vlog. Um, and I just wanted to say thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um... And if you're digging the weekly vlogs, please comment down below, hashtag more weekly vlogs, um, because I'm kind of getting into a flow of it. I'm actually really enjoying it. So I think next week is going to be way more eventful. Um, I'm going to be doing a lot of things around the house and stuff like that. So stay tuned. Make sure you're subscribed and don't forget to turn your bell notification on. Like the video, you know, give it a thumbs up and I'll catch you guys in my next one. Love you. Bye.